The Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra has just appeared on Geekbench, and we've got a first look at its performance and specifications. This latest benchmark test, spotted by 91 Mobiles, gives us an idea of what to expect from Samsung's upcoming flagship. Let's break down the results and key features. The model tested is labeled SMS 938U, likely the US version of the Galaxy S25 Ultra. Here's how it performed single core score. 3069 points multi-core score, 98 points. These results suggest solid performance, but they fall slightly behind the rumored Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 scores, which were expected to be higher. The Galaxy S25 Ultra features an octa-core Qualcomm chip using the ARM 8 instruction set, which differs from the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4's rumored ARM 9.2 architecture. While the base clock speed of this processor is 2.90 GHz, it can go up to 4.19 GHz, slightly slower than the 4.37 GHz of the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4. The tested model comes with 12 GB of RAM. It runs on Android 15, though Samsung hasn't yet released one UI based on this version. Beyond the Geekbench listing, past leaks give us more information about the Galaxy S25 Ultra specs. The phone could sport a 200MP HP 2 main camera with a small upgrade over the S24 Ultra. It might also feature a 50MP ISO CELOJ and 3 ultra-wide camera, replacing the 12MP sensor on the S24 Ultra. For Zoom, we expect a 10MP 3X telephoto and a 50MP 5X telephoto lens. Battery and charging. The phone is expected to have a 5000 mAh battery and support 45W charging, similar to the Galaxy S24 Ultra. However, the charging adapter will likely be sold separately. Leaked renders suggest the Galaxy S25 Ultra could be flatter and lighter than its predecessor. The phone might feature a 6.86-inch dynamic AMOLED display slightly larger than the S24 Ultra's 6.8-inch screen. In conclusion, the Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra promises impressive performance, upgraded cameras, and a sleek design. Stay tuned for more updates as we get closer to its launch.